And get the red light up. Oh yeah, oh, eventually it comes back. Have you been before? I've not been here. No. No. Would you like a nap? I would. Mm. For those in the know. Okay. Just a signature in the box. And I'll put the date in for you. That's Thank great. You Thank you so much. Okay. Enjoy your walk around the garden. Here's Thank the information you. about National Trust Memory. It's really nice. friendly for the chair and all that. But we're, um, we're down here at number one. The house there, which isn't open to the public, but behind it there's a cafe and the toilets are there. Okay. This is the, the um, formal gardens and there are little boxes around with um, mm -hmm. in them is descriptions of the plants okay. and the local facility. And then this is the old region. It's about seven acres in total oh, right, then. between the two. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there's a lot to get around. And then at number five there's a um, shed there with a exhibition of the history of the oh, okay. court and okay. what it was originally when it was a okay. Okay. Anyway, thank you very much. Are you all right like that? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. yeah. No, you need to. Thank, thank you, you thank very much then. Thank you. Enjoy the time. We'll see how we get on with the uh, yeah. the paintings lab. Yeah. <laughs> oh okay. Okay.
back again. Just watch the um, step. There's actually a step there, and oh, I didn't see it. My travel rope today is coming from the beautiful little uh, gardens of the courts and looking in my, t in my handbook for the National Trust it's described the curious English country garden is hidden gem garden rooms of different styles shaped by the vision of the past owners and gardeners. You'll find herbaceous borders, quirky to topiary and peaceful water garden. There's about seven or eight acres apparently. It's quite a, there's actually quite a lot. I think it was seven or eight. Um, doesn't say in my little book though. The actual, uh, obviously you'll see on the video that I had a encounter already and I haven't even started yet, an encounter with a step which I didn't see and uh, apparently that's all there is so once we've got past that and there are steps behind me to, the, to a, a little lower garden, I don't know if you can get round it or not. Open most days. Um, now apparently you can't go into the house itself because it's occupied uh, by tenants so you can't go inside the house, we have to stay in the garden. Ahead of us is the house which we're not going to go in because we can't. Now behind us is a lovely little garden, I don't know if we can get down but there are actually steps there. So we'll have a look, right, probably around the other side we can go in. I'm on the grass at the moment because uh, this um, step here threw me. Ends up getting stuck. So it appears like uh, some areas are grass and some areas are paving slabs. I may have. Uh, we're not going to go down there because it's step. Now, if you're into uh, flowers and stuff, then it's obviously an ideal place to come. It's lastly formal garden. This is the actual uh, formal gardens part. So, can I go down there? I don't know whether I'll get back up or not. Or stream thing. Yeah, it should be alright. Oh. It's very nice, isn't it? If we go down this way, don't know what's down here. You probably wouldn't want to come down here in the rain. Order plans. And also, you wouldn't probably want to want to come if you you've got allergies. A little bit of a pond going on. Apparently there's uh, little signs to tell you what the plants are. I haven't seen any yet. Oh 
in the little pond. Be like David Bellamy. Going through the undergrowth. Some of these are precarious. is we're going to meet people coming the other way. I don't know. Right, you better come because um, I don't know if, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be able to go up that. It's a bit of a lip, bit of a thing going on there. <laughs> Alright. I uh, should be okay. I'm just, I don't know, just debating whether I'm going to bother or not. It's just this bit here. It's like oh, okay. uh, well, I hope you're a bit of a lip. I'm not sure what you can do. It's, um, no, well, let's see. Let's see. If, I know it goes down. I don't know if you've put your foot on it, maybe. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Uh, there you are. That's Perfect. lovely. Thank you. Okay, cheers. All right. Hmm. Got to try and stay on the on the path because be in trouble with them not if I don't. I think it will probably be okay for uh, wheelchairs. More steps down. Lovely tree. There's a sign over there, I can't see it. Do come this way. <laughs> Thank you. It's a bit bumpy, isn't it? Here we have a <laughs> basically it says don't go in the water. You get eaten alive. Hmm. Thank you. Should go this way. Fell up with the bumps. Mm, the tree from my birthday. Oh yeah. Hmm. I would go along there, but it's slightly that I should get stuck. Lilies.
Alice is doing it. I've a box with the Alice They have. It tells you what they are. Very nice. I think this is the informal um, section. It's basically trees. That's um, quite nice, but pretty. The trees. To be fair, once you've seen one tree, they're all very much alike, aren't they? And I believe you can go through there as well. Um, I'm not going to go through there. Well, I haven't said that, there's a very nice tree over there. Ah, we can go for this little bit here. Conveniently. Oh, this is the uh, apple store and orchard, orchard room. So as it says there, uh, the uh, Quartz Garden is laid in the intimate well kept garden in the English style. Uh, it was a uh, waterlogged industrial site with a cloth mill uh, when in the olden days. It's obviously Brother Ivan was a woollen uh, textile town. Now oh, where was that tree? Ah, oh, there was that tree. Hey, tree. Have a look at that tree. Fascinating tree. No idea what it is. But it is fascinating. <laughs> Looks a bit scary, Ren. Growing. It sort of goes on for miles. They might be beehive. Oh, beehive. <laughs> Yes, they are. They're beehives.
spotting shed. Wow, that's lovely. That's really nice. Shall we do a 360 turn, shall we? Right, starting from there. Oh, gone dizzy now. This is this grass is all right because this is quite short. A lot of shapes of these hedges, they're really funny. I've uh, spied the toilet. There's toilets here. Just there, uh, so it looks like. Looks like it's one, one, one for all, all for one. Wow, um, tea room. Of the day, four pound fifty. It smells lovely. Mm. People are eating. And it looks like there's more more toilets for the same toilet. There we go, I've finished my little uh, tour of the courts in Holt. Cut the uh, visit short a little bit because it um, started, <laughs> started to rain a little bit and uh, I was getting a bit wet. In a wheelchair it would be much easier I think uh, especially if you have somebody helping you to to get around if you enjoyed this video then please don't forget to like and share and subscribe to my channel thank you for watching and i'll catch you again very soon for another trouble blow